Well, that's it. I'm totally out of bed now. <laughs> right, as promised, I'm going to make some bread. A full loaf. This size. Hopefully that's the right, right size. Because I know they do raise up a little bit. Anyway, get all this stuff ready on here now. And I'll turn the camera to it. Right. First off, I'm going to need me scales again. Just so I get everything right. Got my water ready there, nice and just hand warm. So, it's nice and easy to mix. Got everything written down again. <laughs> right. First off, for the mix, get the mix ready. The yeast. Eight grams. This is not exact. You don't need to have exactly eight grams, but eight grams will should do it. Right. I'm add the sugar in with this to dissolve it a bit as well. That is another eight grams as well. Hang on. Right. I didn't mean to turn it off. <laughs> anyway, and the salt, say, usually it's teaspoons, a teaspoonful, but I reckon it'll be about eight grams as well. Five. Seven grams will do fine. Swirl that around a bit. I'm not going to add water to it yet. So I'm going to put that all in with the flour mix and then do it in here, uh, knead it into all together. Right, the flour 450 grams of flour. There we go, that's 450. I need that for the mixture when I've done it. Put that there. Right. Now, to put it into the bowl. First off, put that in and the water. Give it a good stir. Get it all over the top again. using warm water it's already started to activate a bit so make sure all the sugar and salt dissolve so. not many pots this time were they <laughs> and all this water in there I 
and now I've got this to mix it all together. With this one I am going to add a little bit of oil so it gives it that golden crusty crunch bit. <laughs> Make sure it's all mixed in. And that should be enough. Hold up. Right, that's all. I'm recording. Yes, I'm recording. That's all nicely made dough together. I'll show you there. Right, and I'm gonna one tablespoon of oil. Put it around the edges. Then more. Right, and I can put that in the water now. And then do a little bit of a uh, swirl it around, get it all mixed into the supposed to put it in like a warmish room but it's quite warm in here today anyway so leave that for one and a half hours and I'm going to show you well right it's been just over an hour for this and it has doubled in size now I'm going to all the air out of it. I am going to make two. I'm going to make a bread size bat for me for my dinner later. <laughs> Tea as we call it in, in England. <coughs> make sure all the air is going out of it. Line that with a bit of uh, marge, yep, that marge, a bit of oil, so it don't stick to the side. It should be easier to get out. should rise again
can see them there. Okay, push it down to the edges. And cover again loosely. And this one I'm going to use on the tray. No, it's not it, it's here. On this tray, I'm going to put some paper on it. I know for the fact that's going to crumble as soon as I open it. <laughs> Sprinkle a bit of that on it. Put some paper on my tray. It's only going on a half a bit, the other half is going to be that. So, leave that for another, another hour or so, and then I'll put it in the oven uh, for, I guess, about five. 25, 20, 20 to 25 minutes, and that should do them both. Right, here we go. I've got my oven heated up for the last 20 minutes, and that's the reason of it. Not sure about the little back one, but that one's okay. Oop. Stick it in the oven for 25 minutes. There we go. There. Good thing about this is <laughs> not much to clean off with just this. I've already cleaned off uh, my bowls and stuff. There we go. If you like my videos, give us a like, comment, and a subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. And I'll show you what it looks like afterwards. And with a bread bap, I'll make a chip butty later, because that's all I'm having for dinner. Um, anyway, see you all later. I'll show you the results afterwards. See you in a bit. Right. Here we are, here we are, here we are. Right. I'm going to take them both out. Together. Don't want to drop them, because... <laughs> Another day, right? Get this right out of all. I'll put it on the cooling rack. Should drop straight out. Oh yes. <laughs> it's a good job it wasn't in it. <laughs> put that in the sink, and then that one there. That one's for me chips later. A bit of close up of it for you. There we have the loaf and the little bat that I've done. Well, thanks again for watching. If you should give us a like, comment, and a subscribe. I'll see you all next time.